hesitant to 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 get it? Uh, I, I would start with um, I've, I've had COVID um, in the past, and so our, our understanding of antibodies, of natural immunity, has uh, changed a, a great deal from the onset of the pandemic, and is still evolving. Um, I understand that the vaccine would uh, um, help if, if if you catch COVID and uh, you'll be able to have less symptoms um, from contracting it. But with me having COVID in the past and having antibodies um, with my current um, age group and uh, uh, fitness, physical fitness level, um, it's not necessarily a fear of mine. Uh, taking the vaccine, um, like I said, it would decrease my chances of uh, uh, having a severe reaction, but it does open me up to the, albeit rare chance, but the possibility of having an adverse reaction to the vaccine itself. Um, I don't believe that being unvaccinated means infected or being vaccinated means um, uninfected. You can still catch COVID um, with or with not having the vaccine. Um, I would say, honestly, the, the, the craziness of it all in terms of not being able to say that it should be everybody's fair choice without being demeaned or um, talked crazy to doesn't uh, make one comfortable to do what said person is uh, telling them to do. Um, yeah, I, I would say that's, that's a couple of the reasons that, um, you know, I would say I, I'm hesitant at this time, but at the end of the day, uh, I don't feel that it is, um, you know, anyone's reason to come out and say, well, this is why, or this is not why it should just be their decision. and. Um, you know, loving your neighbors, not just loving those that, that agree with you or look like you or uh, move in the same way that you do. It's, it's uh, uh, you know, loving those who don't. Is everybody in here vax? I would assume, right? So you all can still get COVID, right? Okay, but you can still get COVID. Right. So... And you can still pass it along with the vax, right? I'm not asking, I'm just asking a question. I don't want to put in your mouth, but to having it change your opinion one way or another, like that it kind of re-emphasize that I don't need the vaccine. No, 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 no. No, that didn't, that wasn't the case. I mean, yeah, I had it, but that doesn't mean I can't get it again, you know? I mean, it's no different than somebody with the vaccine. Like, I can, yes, I developed the antibodies for it, so my chances will be less likely now as well. That would be like me telling him, like, yo, your wife is going into labor. How dare you leave this team and not go tend to your wife for what that could mean for this team? That's That's something that's personal to him. That's health related that's you know something that's personal to his family this is no different uh this is you know we're dealing with something that to me feels like has turned into a political war um when, when you're talking about a vaccination and non-vaccinated uh, i think it's become very political and you know for someone who's not extremely into politics uh, when, when you make something so political and people, not everyone is into politics, then you can also turn those people off, you know? And, you know, I think there is something to be, something to be said for people's concern about something that's being pressed so hard. Like, why are you pressing this so hard? Like so much, you're just pressing and pressing and pressing. I think you have to honor people's feelings and and their own personal beliefs. And I think that's been lost um, when it comes to va vaccinated and non-vaccinated. Uh, and it, it kind of sucks that that's been lost um, because you you're essentially not giving anyone. Uh, we you know you say we live in a land of the free. Well, you're not giving anyone freedom because you're making people do something essentially uh, without necessarily making them, you're making them do something. And that goes against everything that America stands for or supposedly stands for. And so I don't think, no, I know I'm not in any position to go tell him what he, what he should or should not be doing. 
Um, and I, as a leader of this team, I'm not going to go to him and say, hey, man, we really need no the hell. You do what you feel you want to do. That that has nothing. I'm not going to go and ask him, did he get a polio vaccine? Uh, so why would I go ask him if he got a COVID vaccine?